you went through and you're just finishing the limited registration process of being yeah. a limited registered physio in Australia. Um, so tell us a bit about that because a lot of people are interested in that and um, I came to Australia and I was registered as a physio in New Zealand so I sort of did a bit there first um, and then sort of transitioned to work over here through to the general registration but the main I guess um, pathway for overseas applicants is a limited registration pathway which can be um, lengthy uh, and a little bit challenging sometimes. So tell us a little bit about your experience with that. Yeah, so I am um, yeah, um, getting to the end of that process now, which is which is good. Um, obviously, the whole process was quite delayed for me with um, you know COVID and stuff. So after submitting my initial application and getting the you know approval um, to come over and start working and things, there was a bit of a gap between that happening. Um, but um, otherwise, it's a pretty sort of smooth process, um, and it's quite a nice. I found um, a good way to actually integrate into um, you know how things work here in Australia and stuff and um, obviously because coming from South Africa things do work a little bit differently so it, it you know you you guided really well along the whole process and you've given a lot of support which is something I really enjoyed um, and you know having knowing you've got someone that you can you know kind of contact at any moment to ask questions um, is really good so yeah basically working um, under supervision and having a supervisor um, and then, yeah, just doing, you know, regular check-ins and things is, is really, really helpful. Um, and then, um, yeah, leading up to the exam. So um, I decided to write the exam um, in like the previous June. Um, and so I'd been working for about a year here, which I felt was really good because I had a, a better understanding of like the system and things, you know, um, the way things work in Australia, um, which is which is awesome. So I feel like it does prepare you a little bit better for um, the exam and sort of that expectation um, of the exam. So um, yeah, and then so writing the exam was definitely lots of studying, yeah, um, well, lots of hard work. The exam, um, three three exams, is that correct? So um, I guess so that's I a bit was... of a challenge because there's different areas, isn't there? So if you, for example, specialise in musculoskeletal. Um, You've still got to obviously do your exams in, in the other areas such as respiratory and neuro. Is, is that correct? Yeah. So I, I'm lucky in that um, South Africa has what they call a flyer stream. So sort of a, a faster way um, of doing the process. So I was fortunate enough to only have to do the written exam. But yes, it's, you know, you you assessed on all areas of physio. So, you know, it's pediatrics, it's um respiratory it's musculoskeletal it's neuro um and you know they can ask anything so um just the the way they ask the exam it's difficult to obviously predict you don't know what they're going to ask you really need to be prepared for anything um and then yes yeah, so i was lucky i only have to write the one exam so um but if i know a lot of other pathways just depending on which countries you're coming from there's a clinical assessment as well and then there's yeah. three actual like three separate assessments in each of those um areas so that being musculoskeletal um neuro and then like respiratory cardiac area yeah yeah, good. The flyer stream, I think, is a bit of a newer initiative as well, isn't it? Um, I don't think that used to be available. So um, I, I think everybody had to do all of it previously. But by the sounds of it, the flyer stream certainly uh, streamlines that process. Yes. Because you can also do, I believe, a, what's called an equivalence of qualification. Whereas if you're university and the year that you graduated, I think, if they've already yeah. assessed somebody from that, um from that university and year then you can sort of do a direct sort of conversion as well which is which is a bit easier yes um yeah but i think there's just lots of paperwork that's involved um yeah. and those kind of things so we were they sort of advised that we go the the yeah. exam pathway because it's just a little bit yeah, simpler good. In, a, in a way and, and you're nearly there which is good news yes <laughs> <laughs> long road yeah, it's definitely been a long road because of COVID as well. So, yes, um, yes. Okay.